I'm Sophia DeCaro, the Executive Director of the Governor's Office of Planning and Budget. I grew up in a small town in Carbon County. My father was a coal miner and my mother was a seamstress. She had a small business in the basement of our home and she was from Japan. And uh, there's a word in Japanese that I think captures kind of how we grew up and just kind of the uh, Carbon County culture, if you will. And, and that, uh, that Japanese word is gambaru and gambaru means perseverance and it's kind of this idea that um, you not only do your best or strive to do your best but you strive to do better than your best we did recently reorganize the office uh, as governor cox uh, and lieutenant governor henderson took office and uh, the office is focused uh, heavily on uh, making sure that we drive the best investment and use of Utah's resources. So that is our primary focus in the office because we are uh, one of the very few agencies where we get to look at everything from a statewide perspective. Uh, when you're in an agency, sometimes you're focused on what you have to execute and, um, and your sliver of the pie and we get to see the entire pie and how all of that works together and that's uh, a really enjoyable thing for, uh, for our office. Um, one of the, the unique quirky things that, um, that we do that uh, maybe people don't realize that we do is um, we, we do meet to have consensus on um, population projections, on um, revenue consensus. Uh, the uh, Department of Alcohol um, Beverage Control, they actually base their licenses, the number of licenses they have to award each year, get based on the numbers we agree on, um, which is unique. So they have to calculate how many licenses will be available uh, based on population. We have an incredible team in the Governor's Office of Planning and Budget. Uh, we have an incredible staff that uh, we have a lot of sm very smart people in, um, in our department who are evaluating things and, um, and looking at things and uh, so much of the work that's happening behind the scenes are done um, and, and the, the taxpayers, the citizens of Utah will never see a lot of that activity, but uh, it's a very rewarding thing to see these people work behind the scenes for the, uh, the people of the state of Utah. And uh, I just want to convey that uh, how, how lucky we are to have the people in place that we have doing the work that, that they're doing on behalf of Utah citizens.